Microbes are everywhere there is water. Not all of them are dangerous. There are some inside our body and necessary for life. But other microorganisms are dangerous and can cause diseases, since they can be pathogens, infectious agents or germs. Disinfection, sanitization and pasteurization are different types of sterilizations. They deactivate or eliminate all forms of life and other biological agents which are present. Many products require sterilization. Surgical instruments and medication that enter an already aseptic part of the body, such as the bloodstream or penetrating the skin, must be sterile. Otherwise, they may endanger the health of the patient. Food products, such as milk, juices, beer and so on, need to be treated before consuming. As an example, milk can undergo the ultra-high temperature sterilization called UHT. Milk is heated above 135 degrees Celsius, the temperature required to keep pour for 1 to 2 seconds. Then, if the milk is packed in a sterile container, its shelf life increases from about 7 days up to 9 months. During everyday life, people commonly use sterilization methods. If you ever get a scratch, most likely you use hydrogen peroxide to clean the scratch. This is used also to prevent infections. Sterilization is obtained with a chemical. Also at home, when you make some jam, you have to sterilize the jar in order to preserve it for a longer time. In this case, sterilization is obtained with heat. The jar is kept at 130 degrees Celsius for 20 minutes. Sterilization can also be obtained by high pressure, filtration and also by ionizing radiation emitted by the radionuclides. Sterilization by ionizing radiation provides a clean way to sterilize things without leaving a chemical residue. Moreover, it is achieved faster than by other conventional methods and under suitable conditions without degrading the material. Due to its advantages over heat and chemical-based sterilization techniques, this method is particularly attractive in medicine and healthcare-related fields. Different types of radiation can be used for sterilization purposes, gamma, electrons and X-ray. Each one has different properties, such as penetration capability, and it can be used for different applications, leading to the same beneficial effect. The radiation energy released in matter leads to the formation of ionized or excited species that give rise to reactive species responsible for the damage. Sterilization takes advantage from the high radiation sensitivity of microorganism DNA. By adopting suitable radiation conditions, it is possible to completely eliminate the harmful pathogens in the sterilization process, but also to achieve other useful effects. Indeed, in the case of food, ionizing radiation could also be effective in delaying vegetable sprouting or to prevent insects growing in seed. This could lead to economical benefits in reducing spoilage and increasing the agricultural productivity. Sterilization by radiation of food as well as healthcare products is well regulated all around the world to guarantee the product quality, the treatment safety and the health of workers and public.